Uh, I want us to explain example 13 part A whereby we are told by expanding sine 2a plus a show that sine 3a is equals to 3 sine a minus 4 sine cubed a and before we go far it is important for everybody to know that uh, we have not had sine 3a so we can express this one in terms of sine 2a plus a because this is sine 3a and um, at that point sine 2a plus a this one we know it to be sine 2a sine 2a cos a plus cos 2a sine a at this point we would wish to talk of uh, we would wish to talk about what we know sine 2a can be expressed in terms of um, double angle formulae this one sine 2a we know it to be 2 sine a cos a 2 sine a cos a so the whole of this expression becomes 2 sine a cos a multiplied by cos a because up to there we have it here but of course we need to bring on board cosine a plus what what is cosine 2a uh, this is another area we need to be very careful and because our final answer is given in terms of signs then it is advisable to express cosine 2a in terms of signs and yet we know yes cosine 2a can be expressed in three different ways as we learned earlier but the one that we are going to employ here is that um, cosine 2a is 1 minus 2 sine squared of a 1 minus 2 sine squared of a of course multiplied by the sine the sine of a fine um, when you open this bracket you're going to find something to do with 2 uh, sine a cos squared a because of this cos times this cos plus open this bracket sine a minus 3 sine cubed a uh, minus 2 not 3 2 2 sine cubed of a uh, at, at that particular point we would wish to say that as much as we have the cosine squared of a again using the very original rule that we know that from sine squared a plus cos squared a to be equals to one then the cosine squared of a can be one minus the sine squared of a and that is where we are this one has to be expressed this way so two sine a open bracket one minus the sine squared of a close bracket plus sine a minus 2 sine cubed of a that is true if we happen now to open this bracket you're going to have you're going to have 2 uh, sine of a minus 2 sine cubed of a plus sine a minus 2 sine cubed of a we are now getting somewhere of course and if you collect the like terms if you collect the like terms <clears throat> uh, if we collect the like terms we can already see that if we bring sine a this other side we are going to have 2 sine a ma uh, 2 sine a plus 2 sine a plus sine a minus 
2 sine cubed of a minus 2 sine cubed of a. This gives us 2 sine a plus sine a is 3 sine a minus 4 sine cubed of a. 4 sine cubed of a. And uh, that is just the like it. We have proved, we have been able to hence shown. Please note that this one is a bit um, a bit tough. Uh, bring every kind of trigonometric relationship that you know. At the end of the day, you are supposed to be getting there. All right.